so my nails are done i forgot to film an uh, intro yesterday so you're already seeing my nails done <laughs> oopsies but everything else is not done so listen up today i'm going to be forcing a glow up because um she kind of needs it so so step number one was to get my nails done because they looked very raggedy i have really long nails in general but it was like like my nails just rip really fast Step number one, check. Now we're gonna get into my face because she definitely needs it. I will be, I will be um, <laughs> plucking my eyebrows and shaving my face. Oh wow, I can see like every single hair in detail. You know what they say, beauty is pain, beauty is pain. I used to shave my eyebrows when I was little. I had like such a big gap in between my eyebrows. So I started plucking my eyebrows and yeah, my life has been better since. It does hurt, but nowhere compared to how stupid I looked with such a big gap. It, like you could make a whole London bridge in my between my eyebrows. I am back and my eyebrows are tweezed up. Now we're gonna move on to shaving my face. I haven't ever shaved my face really like that, so I will be trying that. I put my hair up so I can, you know, put some face oil on my face. And I use the Palmer's Cocoa Butter. It's literally on Amazon and I use one of these. So let's see, I have never done this, so. <laughs> I'm probably not gonna film me shaving my face only because I, it's my first time. I'm not really equipped. I don't know how to do it really that well. So I'll probably just update you once my face is all shaved. I don't want to make like a fool of myself on camera. You know, you have to look like this so you can look hot, you know, just whatever. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Do you see that? It is working. So that's a little update. Now let me finish the rest. Mm. So now I'm kind of done with shaving my face. Uh, I look a little, uh, I have a lot of redness from shaving my face. I don't know if that's normal, but you know. Now I'm gonna go in and do a face mask. So I'm gonna go in with I'm Rice face mask by Tony Molly. And I, oh my god, why do I look like this? Hopefully this is a glow up, not a glow down. We shall pray. This whole like school year, I have kind of decided to not look like a bum every time I leave. Not even this school year, this year, I have promised myself to not look like a bum every time I leave the house. Because you know what's funny? Every time I leave the house looking like a bum, I see every single person I should not be seeing. And when I look so good, I look like a whole model, okay? Like Vogue hire me right now. Um, uh, I don't see any single person that I know, which is fine, but like... It's like, why am I looking homeless? And I see people that I'm like, oh my god, I need to run away. I have learned my lesson. I went to the temple um, New Year's and I literally saw people I should not be seeing. And I was looking so ratchet, raggedy, rusty. And then I had to pretend like I just don't know them and I can't see and I'm blind. So that was also very fun. So I have taken the face mask off and my skin is so smooth and soft. I am literally in love with it. But there is still a little bit of redness from the face mask and when I shaved my face. So we're just gonna have to bear with it for now. Let me actually put on some chapstick because um, she's getting a little dry. I literally don't like winter. I hate how often my lips get so chapped and they get like, they shrink in size. And I'm like, why are we shrinking in size? My suitcase just fell on my leg. Now that my lips are not chapped. So I was gonna do my hair care. Like I was gonna do, put the oils in my hair and wash it off. But I, um, I already washed my hair yesterday. I kind of needed to. So I'm gonna give you guys a little secret on how I've been growing growing my hair because i've cut it like remember i cut it yeah never doing that again but um i cut my hair till here and now it's pretty long and it's it's been growing for a little bit like she's honestly like doing good and i feel like also that my hair has just gotten so much more um fuller like i don't know how to explain it but i think it's because of my hair care and i never really talked about it so i'm gonna talk about it right now and I was sleeping and I realized that there's literally baby hairs coming out Which means my hair is growing in the spaces that my hair wasn't growing before So I think it's working, so I'm gonna share it If you actually hear the things I do for um, my hair care, you're gonna be like, that's all? I'm like, yep So, number one, I go in with this I know, I... Yeah, we've seen this enough on TikTok, I know, I know, but 
this thing actually works so well i don't know how i don't know how this works so well but it does and i'm so grateful for that because i have never found anything that grows my hair out like this does i usually just put it on the roots of my hair like i put it wherever there's like no hair like literally over here i used to have i used to just like not have that much hair and you can kind of see i'm like i don't know how to show it like there's literally like baby hairs coming out and i'm like where is this coming out from like i've not like done anything different and then i realized now it's my hair oil and on top of that i don't really dye my hair like i did have a little bit of a phase last year where i dyed my hair um blonde and then i dyed my hair brown and then i went back to black but honestly i kind of got lucky because i bleached my hair one time and i guess i didn't do it too much so my hair is not dry and it's not like it's not brittle it's not brittle br brittle but also to keep my hair healthy i use um this thing works <laughs> wonders i usually use it for the bottom of my hair i kind of just like so it doesn't get dry i kind of like put a little bit on and then when i wash it my hair is just so it's kind of oily i can't lie because i don't know how to wash it properly and this stuff is kind of heavy the second wash my hair is a lot more fluffier like this it's over here and my hair was over here it grew like this much so definitely recommend it i have gotten this tool let me find it real quick so this is what i use to usually like rub it in my scalp so my oils can go in better so with the little lighting that i do have left let's start the makeup process i will kind of be doing just like a quick little get ready with me like quick little glow up so i don't look like absolute why is the sun my op in every single video i do oh my god i literally hate the sun i'm gonna do kind of like a light base and we'll figure out from there what i do so i'll go in with my primer real quick um so yesterday i went to this arcade place with my friend i vlogged it so it might be my next video but that place was actually so funny like it was fun okay let, let me let me let me let me let me elaborate further so basically we like went in and we were just like first of all the line was so long going in with my elf halo glow medium tan i think medium bronze oh have i been saying the name wrong all this time anyways so we went to the place and we were like okay we made a reservation like whatever like we should be getting our stuff anytime soon like getting time to play our reservation was at seven we got there at seven and the line was so long to the point that we actually ended up waiting in line for 30 minutes after getting the reservation we had like a two hour pass so seven to nine i'm gonna go in with my other shade of elf halo glow so i can do it my contour we went into that place and we literally did not know what to do we were so confused like nobody was telling us anything there were no instructions there we were like what is this like i was like am i just supposed to like figure it out like what um but we did end up figuring it out at the end and it was honestly so fun like i'm so excited for my next video because i'll put all the clips in there of us doing it it was actually so funny but yeah other than that my school is starting in literally two days and i can never be sadder i'm actually like depressed no I'm not. like i don't know i feel like this winter break that we had was actually so short i mean i was complaining about being home but i'm also complaining about going back to school <laughs> Now that my contouring is done, I'm gonna go in with my foundation. Like, I'm actually so sad about my school starting because I just know I'm gonna have so much to do and I don't know how I'm gonna pump out so many videos weekly. Once a week is so hard to do when you have school. I thought it was gonna be easy, but it's not. Which I'm kind of sad about because I want to make more videos, but I just know if I do anything more than... Honestly, I can't even have a schedule because my classes and stuff are just so unpredictable. And then after all of that, I have like no energy. Hopefully that makes me have a more productive routine. I feel like I have a more productive routine when I'm like busy. Like if I have so many things to do, I have such a good routine. And then when I have nothing to do and I think I'm going to have a better routine because I have so much free time. So I can do a lot more things that I want to do. I get so lazy that I just stay in bed and watch Netflix. My skin is looking nice. I'm gonna go in with a teeny tiny bit of concealer under my eyes and a little bit near my eyebrows. And a little bit of my smile lines. Just gonna do a little bit, not too much. Don't want it to look cakey. I've been wearing so much makeup recently, my skin is actually crying. Tribal member check. Um, if you don't look like a tribal member after... 
if you don't look like a tribal member after um your concealer placement you're doing it wrong i don't know if this is just me but i need to share it to get it off my chest so maybe it is me it's not me i don't know but like i have literally been like i usually go to bed listening to music right like i have my headphones in and i just like listen to music and sleep and i wake up every single morning i'm like oh my god i just fell asleep listening to music with my headphones and like i'm gonna have to find my headphones again like where are they and every single time they magically get into my airpod case i don't know how like please tell me i'm not the only one this happens to like is there a ghost coming into my room just like like this literally happened to me right now like this this night i was listening to music and i fell asleep and i literally wake up and I'm like, oh, I completely forgot to put my headphones in my AirPod case. And they were somehow in my AirPod case. And I'm like, I did not put it there. I'm gonna go in with my Rare Beauty. Um, I still don't know what look I'm going for. I'm just going for some look. I don't know what look though, but... I'm also gonna go in with my Putty Blush. I think this is the shade Tahiti, right? Oh, it was the shade Turks and Caicos. <laughs> Oopsies. I'm probably butchering that name, but whatever. Now that my blush is done, I'm thinking of doing kind of like a smoky eye. So I'm gonna just put some brown. I love doing this even for my everyday look because since I'm brown, like it doesn't really stand out on my... It looks natural. Like it doesn't look like I'm catfishing. Like I'm literally wearing like tons of makeup. It doesn't look like that. It looks pretty natural. I know I look crazy right now, but we're gonna go in with the empty fluffy brush and we're gonna blend it. This is literally my secret to having like the best eyeliner, like the most blended, seamless eyeliner is just blending it with like a fluffy brush that has nothing on it. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly do my eyebrows. We're gonna just fill it in a little bit. I feel like eyebrows like frame my face so much. Like if I have... If my eyebrows are just not done, I actually look so bad. So I'm gonna use my She Glam Brow Gel and just... But yeah, I was saying that I literally love when my eyebrows are just done because they make me look so much more put together compared to when my eyebrows are just not done. But eyebrows are such a big part of your face. Like, if you want to force a glow up, get your eyebrows done. Do something new to your eyebrows. Your glow up is already like halfway there. I'm also going to go in with a little bit of shimmery eyeshadow and put it up here. I feel like that's like my signature makeup. A brown eyeshadow and then like a glittery eyeshadow. I don't know why it just completes the look for me. Now I'm just gonna do like a quick eyeliner. Like a quick small eyeliner. I'm gonna be using my handy dandy mirror to do my eyeliner because I literally cannot. So I have finished my eyeliner and now I'm gonna put on some mascara and powder and we'll see where this is going. I'm gonna go in with my telescopic real quick and just... I feel like adding mascara just makes my eyes look so much bigger. Like I literally love that. I was gonna contour my nose but I just am like not feeling a nose contour right now. Um, I am gonna add some black waterline eyeliner just because I want to give a little Finally, the sun is kind of going away. I literally hate the sun when I'm recording. It's literally so annoying You can just see like this whole video. I'm just mad. I'm gonna be going in with my Oh, and I'm not gonna do it all the way because I feel like that makes my eyes look smaller. So I'm just gonna do it like halfway I feel like I'm doing my makeup like a barbarian right now. I feel like it gives me very cat eye vibes. Like, I'm gonna go in with some... I feel like I'm losing my voice. What's going on? <coughs> also, I completely forgot to mention this. Thank you so much for 200 subscribers. Love that for me. Thank you. I literally did not think I would be reaching here. Not me acting like I have 200k, but still you know we gotta appreciate the little things in life like i literally love when you guys comment oh i love your channel like keep doing what you're doing I'm like oh my god stop like i'm literally about to cry like this one person commented that on my last video and i'm not even kidding i was sitting there looking at it for like 30 30 minutes like oh my god like guys somebody like actually likes my videos and i'm not just making a fool of myself on the internet i'm just gonna add powder everywhere hopefully that fixes like half of my makeup i'm gonna go in with my classic spray if my makeup ever looks too cakey, I wear this and my makeup looks like skin again. Like, do you see that? It just gives me, like, shimmer. I'm kind of feeling this Huda Beauty warm brown. I like to add, like, a mix of pinkish vibe to my lip. 
So here's basically the makeup look. 